The time is 7:12. Let's get right over to Peyton Malone with a look at your Easter forecast. Hey, good morning. Yeah, happy Easter. We're waking up. We got beautiful blue skies and uh, it's going to be a very nice day. Pretty similar to yesterday, just a little bit warmer. There's a live look from the West Bank, though, and notice uh, looking across the city, no clouds. It is cool this morning. Likely need a jacket as you head out the door, especially on the North Shore. We're in the mid 40s to low 40s here in a few spots. 41 in Bay St. Louis here in New Orleans. We're ranging from 61 near the lake to 54 at the lake or at the airport and in the low 50s for Homa and Thibodeau and even some upper 40s are up there along the river. So there's a little chill in the air, but it is going to be a very pleasant afternoon. We'll get into the about 74. Uh, it is a little warmer than yesterday, but very comfortable. Lots of sunshine and east winds only about five miles per hour. So we really couldn't have asked for better weather for uh, Easter Sunday when a lot of people are going to be out in the backyard doing crawfish boils and uh, Easter egg hunts, of course. All right, this morning, not a whole lot going on on radar. We do have a light shower that is in lower Terrebonne down near the barrier islands. Uh, but here in New Orleans, something interesting, you know, we've got all the birds migrating through the area and when the sun comes up, they all take flight usually and our radars usually pick it up and you can see there uh, right around sunrise kind of blows up right there. That's birds waking up, taking up uh, and taking to the sky. You can really see them uh, here on radar. So just something interesting. But as I mentioned, this is actual rain, uh, not birds down to the south of Cocodree, uh, drifting ever so slowly just towards the southwest of Port Fouchon. So that's about it. And it is dissipating and it's moving uh, off the coast. So if you're going to go fishing down there, uh, it'll be better later on this morning into the afternoon. By the way, the marine forecast looking pretty good. No advisories uh, out on the boat and on the coast. Only two to four feet today, tonight and tomorrow. Just a light chop there in the lake and it'll be fairly smooth at times with just an east southeast wind only about five to ten knots. So winds aren't going to be a big deal uh, if you're going to be out on the water. All right, no rain today really tomorrow looking good. Tuesday though, looks like we'd have a little disturbance in here. I bumped up our rain chances to a 40%, maybe some on Wednesday and then another round on Thursday going into Friday as a cool front gets in here, but it doesn't look like that cool front's really going to push on in and dry us out completely. So we're going to return to our more unsettled pattern with warmer temperatures and humidity. There's the sunshine through today. Very nice, not a whole lot going on. Maybe a passing upper cloud here and there. Uh, but as we go into Monday, much of the same story, just a few clouds. But what we'll be watching is moisture increasing from the south. We'll get a disturbance in here, and I think we're going to have enough ingredients uh, for some showers and maybe a few downpours to develop on Tuesday. Notice our models by Tuesday afternoon kind of blow up an area of showers and storms right over southeast Louisiana. And there are multiple models doing this, so that's why I bumped up the rain chances on Tuesday, so we could have some heavier rainfall uh, Tuesday afternoon. Something we'll keep an eye on for you. Doesn't look like severe weather though. But look at our temperatures. We get into the 80s by Tuesday as well, and we'll stay in the 80s throughout next week, and our humidity is going to go back up. So we have two more days of the dry weather. Enjoy it because we're going to return to the muggies as we go into Tuesday, and really all this coming work week looks to be fairly uh, humid, and we'll be watching for some showers and storms. So we got two more days of the great weather. I hope you have a wonderful Easter and enjoy this fantastic weather in the mid 70s, upper 70s tomorrow and then warming up even more with more humidity and storms into the into the work week. We will take the dry weather while we got it. Thank you so much, Peyton.